Hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. I've already copied my save file over in case of recording failure, and oh, what is this new symbol on here? How convenient that I started here to show you that. <laughs> yeah, that's the one for the fire temple. Alright, let's get out of here. I'm very worried about Anjin. Let's hurry back to the Tower of Spirits. Are you ready to go, Link? Let's go! Woohoo! But first, rabbits! Yes, I made a promise to the people, and I intend on keeping it. As princess of the kingdom, you must understand that as well, because you got to serve the people and help them out and stuff, which means we've got to get the rabbits. So I'm going to go around and sort of like do a, a spiral of sorts, just to cover all the, uh, all the new ground that we haven't covered before, I suppose. That looks like a good path to go, so... <laughs> Alright, I believe at this point we're able to get eight of the little stinkers. Okay, let's head back to the Tower of Spirits! Weren't you listening to me? We have to help the people with their rabbit problems! <laughs> yeah! Oh, oh, there's one right there. Aha! Right, let's see if we can get our first fire rabbits. Ooh, oh, dang it, dang it, dang it, ooh, oh shoot, it's so tricky to get a precise touch on these suckers, yeah! We finally got one! <laughs> Alright, so now, we can just continue on following our path here, and just keep looping around. Well, actually, we've kind of been here before, haven't we? So, no, you know what we could do, I think... I think we could actually speed this along by doing, I, I hope doing a different sort of route here, because I, I don't think I went around those corners. I don't think I went around there. Yeah, I think that'll lead us through all the rabbits, plus it'll show us all the paths that we have not taken yet. So I will redirect our route that way. At least, at, at least I think that's where all the wascally rabbits are around. And die, sign, die! <laughs> could, could you imagine the, the people that have to replace these signs as we're blowing up? They're, pro they're probably coming over here and they're seeing, Well, who the heck is blowing these things up? I just replaced them yesterday! <laughs> oh, oh, shoot, you tricky SOB. <laughs> Yeah, I got it! <laughs> that makes two. <laughs> two out of like eight, as I think. Yeah, so could be a little while. So let's just enjoy the sights of the new tracks. The beautiful mountain ranges. Now they're not being pelted by fiery boulders of death. Well, I guess they weren't that bad. You just kind of shoot at them once with their can, and then they're dispersed. But still, but still, and obviously there's a, there's a. Oh, maybe that. I was gonna say obviously there's a, a set of tracks going that way. But maybe that's not the new set of tracks that we'll get uh, in the future later. Maybe not. Maybe not. <laughs> I could be thinking of another area along this edge. Actually, I think it's long. Yeah, that edge. That's the the hilly area. Could be wrong though. But in any case. I do believe we are coming up to a rabbit somewhere around here. I think it's like somewhere around this middle area. That's why I made sure that my routes always cross there. But yeah, I'm, I'm looking for five just around the fire temple area. So yeah, I'm just kind of just kind of skimming around here, seeing what may oh there we go what may or may not yield a rabbit. They just sit sliding down the hill. Oh, this one's this one's kind of aggressive. Oh, oh, yeah. oh, I might have to restart this one. Oh shoot, that was not a good touch. I thought it was gonna go in the direction that was pointing. Oh shoot! Okay, so I'm gonna have to come back to that one. So it was around over here somewhere. Yeah. So I just marked that and come back to that after I go inside the fire temple to reset the area or something like that. That's okay though. That's okay, we still have unlimited shots to get the rabbits that we need, so we have all the time in the world! But the, the, 
people who are replacing the signs, they probably cannot keep up with us. <laughs> Let's be honest here. Uh, oh, there it is. At this corner. Yes, yes, yes. Web it, web it, web it, web it. Oh, this is a really awkward one. Oh, wow! Because <laughs> he was sliding sideways. Nailed it! <laughs> Alright, that takes care of that. And now, um... Maybe I'll actually go to the Fire Temple and just reset this. But not after I finish going down this route first, of course, to show you... To show you the sights of nature for you to be in awe of as things pop into existence. <laughs> uh, phone is ringing. Uh, um, hold on. <laughs> Alright, phone is over. <laughs> And it's also appearing to be over with this particular route here, so I guess I can uh, cut ahead again. Alright, we're over here again, and man, he just replaced that sign a minute ago! <laughs> so alright, round two with this Waskily Webbit. Oh no, no, this one is terribly, terribly aggressive. <laughs> Uh, oh shoot, I'm trying to predict its movement based on where it's ah, based on where it's pointing, but alas, alas, it got away from me again. You know what? I'm gonna leave that other rabbit for now. I'm just gonna go ahead and flop on down to the new corner that I don't think I've ridden down through before because I do believe there is a rabbit down there too, so yeah, let's just take a break from the her Was that the phone again? Oh my Arceus! Jeez, don't they realize I'm being under attack by tanks? <laughs> Apparently not, dang it. Okay, blast these tanks to oblivion! <laughs> Man, they have really good traction too, by the way. If you didn't notice that I'm going down the side of the mountain there. Oh, oh no, one, one more, one more. Oh shoot, the shot's going up that way. Okay, there we go, there we go. <laughs> and oh, now we're being attacked by you. Uh huh. Uh huh. That's not. That's that. I. I will not accept this. <laughs> Where are you now? Anyway, I'm facing the. Oh, you're running away. Okay. I was gonna say I'm facing the direction. All right. Here's the other rabbit that I thought was at this corner. And ah, see the trouble with the rabbits is that you don't know when they're gonna start moving and when they're gonna stop moving, and then you try and throw the net in front of them, but there's a delay uh, between when you touch and when the net lands, so you don't know if they're gonna turn direction or not or something like that. And yeah, it's 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 a tricky endeavor to get these rabbits. By the way, arch right there. There we go. Always make notes on your maps. Whenever you see an arch, all right, back to the fire temple because I still have to get this rabbit over here. All right, round three for this SOB. <laughs> yeah, dang you, dang you. It's just so, so finicky, so, so jumpy. Oh no! Round four. I'm gonna send this rabbit out the door. <laughs> Hopefully. Oh, jeez, I've seen you stop, so I touch really quick and. Eh. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. Oh, no, 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 no. Why is this one so hard? I don't know what it is about you, but you're most certainly different than the others. Ah, <laughs> uh, so unpredictable. So. Mm, mm, no, 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 no. Oh, shoot. Ow. Round six, pick up sticks, maybe? Oh shoot, this one is, it's like it's so fast. Oh geez, I almost had it there. Oh, yeah! Woo! Finally! <laughs> that means, bye-bye. Rock side attack! Blow them into smithereens! Alright, so now we are coming up to this spot, which means there's that rabbit to get over there, but I also think that there is one back over here. Oh, well, maybe that's on a different route, but I'm just gonna go down there anyway. 
Uh, I didn't take this route before, and then we go straight to the temple. Wait, no, actually, I'll go over to the uh, Goron range after that, but well, but well, we don't have to change our route until we get over here anyway, so I don't really feel like doodling that much. Because, <laughs> yeah, I did plan on going over to the uh, Goron firing range as well, because uh, that should now be open too, and that's another thing that I promised you. <laughs> Once I got everything settled down in the fire range and whatnot, so yeah, it should be a good thing to relax on after having so, so many rabbit difficulties. <laughs> so now we're going along this... Oh, no, you guys, you guys have got to go. You're in, you're in my way. Well, technically not, because I just blast you before you even get in my way. <laughs> So now we're looking for the rabbit that we marked down at the corner here at some point. Let's see here. I'll just keep blowing up the signs. Yes, blowing up the signs is the answer to all of life's troubles. Oh, this is the downhill rabbit. Ooh, I was close. I'm trying to touch it in the direction that they're going. Yes, there we go. Yeah, because these, these rabbits here... They are significantly more aggressive than your average rabbit. <laughs> Alright, so new route, I think, because I... Yeah, I didn't come here before, because I, I must have taken the other route. Well, maybe I didn't. Maybe I took this route to um, at one, one other point. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I'm sure I took it at some playthrough, but I don't know if I took it in this playthrough. That is the thing. <laughs> Not that you couldn't see that there was a little area down that way. Speaking of, I should erase this now. There we go. And also, I think there's a rabbit over here somewhere. Yeah, yeah. So, just put a mark there for ye olde future. And continue on our blasting spree of all the signs in existence. Yeah, I think I went down that way before because I was between the lava. So, yeah, I'm gonna go up this way, and this is the spot, yeah, it's not a very long route or anything uh, that I, I skipped over there. So, yeah, I don't really think that there's anything here, if I recall correctly, but we're just seeing the sights, as I said, on, as a way to travel the world and saving the world and stuff like that. You know, it's, it's part vacation, part adventure. <laughs> So now we're going to be coming up to probably another rabbit around here, so I got to keep my eyes peeled to shoot all the rocks. You can sometimes make a rabbit jump by uh, uh, pulling your whistle here, and it'll pop into vision a little bit easier on. Well, like, watch. You see it bounce? Yeah, well, I just need to shoot that rock. There we go. The chase is on! Oh, wow, that was, that was a pretty quick chase there. <laughs> Okay, so now we've got, well, we've got an enemy sighting, but we've also got a... Where are you? Oh, there you are. So you just kind of popped into existence there. But now we've also got a clear mark on our map. And now we should also, before we take the wrong route, go back to the Goron target range. Oh, it wasn't the firing range, it was the target range. Close enough! Close enough. <laughs> now, there are two mini games here, but they're both basically played out the same way. Uh, you unlock the level 2 ver version of this after you get a thousand points, so definitely go for a thousand points. And uh, you, when, whenever you finish, you always, always, always want to take the small treasure chest, because the large treasure chest always seems to, t to contain rupees of a smaller value than the treasure that you would actually be able to trade into lineback. So, yeah. <laughs> this place is pretty much all for the rupees, but it's a fun minigame in on itself, and it doesn't take too long to play each round either, so I thought, eh, as long as I'm in the area, I would flop on over here. Because this place should be open, and also you cannot stop your train or change direction with your train, it's all like on-rail shooter. Welcome, this is the Goron Target Range. As you can see, it is a special place. It is special because we built it all by hand. But it has been a long time since we had a human challenger. Would you like to try it? It costs 20 rupees. Sure, I have the rupees to spare. By the way, there are no wallet upgrades in this game. You automatically start with a wallet that can hold the maximum of 9,999 rupees. 
There are three kinds of targets, each kind is a different point value. But be careful not to shoot any Goron faces! If you do, you'll get a big scary lecture. <laughs> Depending on your score, you might win a fabulous prize. Do not pick the big chest! Ever! <laughs> Alright, good luck. <laughs> that big chest is just there to tempt you, thinking it's gonna be a humongous prize of awesomeness. I turned on the engine so it will go on its own towards the goal line. Now this is Route 1. See, it leads through here, and then the goal is here, but the level two will continue on through here. Concentrate and try to hit the targets. All we gotta do is fire our cannon. It's how things roll. We can move our camera around as usual and stuff like that. And we shoot! We score! Woo! The up blue targets worth 10 points. This is all super self-explanatory. Just do not, and I repeat, do not shoot! The uh, um, Goron faces. You and you should very easily be able to get 1,000 points by the end of this. Yeah, you can shoot the red targets three times there, and also watch out for targets that flip on you. Like they could change from a target and flip over to a Goron face. They're just there to fake you out and mess you up. <laughs> That's why I'm kind of delaying. Wow, we're going really fast there. <laughs> That's why I'm kind of delaying my shots to make sure that they aren't going to change it to some Goron face or something like that. Oh shoot, that was a fail. Oh shoot! <laughs> well, I already lost some points there, but maybe I could still pull it off, maybe? As long as I stay true to my shooting, I could maybe, because the level one isn't that difficult or anything like that. Oh, there it is. Oh, oh, shoot. I, I, I could have milked that for more. Ah, burst. <laughs> Blast you into smithereens! <laughs> Aha! See, it changed to a gore on there. You just gotta be very careful about that. On the ah, on these rotating ones, you cannot shoot it when the gore on is facing you. And there'll be a, a, a faster opportunity to get points later on in the uh, the charge, I guess you could say here. Dang it! Ah! <laughs> yeah. So let's say. Uh, oh man. Oh, this is a double-sided. Yeah. Okay. This is. Oh, jeez! Oh, balloons! Balloons everywhere! <laughs> This is the point where it's the fastest point to get, I mean, yeah, fastest point to get yourself some points. Yeah, always shoot the red ones three times if you can. Yeah. Oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot. Can I get, I think I can still get this one. Yeah, I can still get that one. <laughs> 920, oh shoot, this is, this is looking ugly. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh shoot, oh. Well, 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 hold on, hold on. Oh, did I come up just a bit short? Oh, really? <laughs> I thought I was gonna have it, but I should have just kept facing that. Uh huh, yes, 980 points. Yes, that's enough for a prize. Do you want the big treasure chest or the little one? The little one, of course. <laughs> Woo, pirate necklace! Woo! That would have been, I believe, 20 rupees if I would have picked the big chest. I would most certainly like to try that again. Oh shoot, I wanted to hit now. I thought that, yeah, 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 yeah. I thought that the now was gonna be at the bottom and I instinctively went for the bottom one. <laughs> All right, so that first one is just a practice run. <laughs> yeah, I gotta watch those Gorons a little bit better. Gotta be a little more diligent to not to reduce my score by shooting Goron faces. <laughs> yeah, I know these first ones are uh, are safe. Yeah, they, they all they appear in the same order, but it's uh, but I mainly just react to them. <laughs> like you know, they appear at the same places every time, so you could in theory just memorize the whole route and get the absolute maximum score possible with the most perfect timing possible, but I don't have this game memorized to that extent, so I'm just going by improvisation. <laughs> Alright, watch for the Gorons. I'm gonna be a little bit more calm this time, and not shoot things like a madman. There we go. <laughs> there we go, that's a lot better, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. See how nice it is when you don't panic? <laughs> Alright, so now they're gonna do the, the rotational, sational dealio here. Oh, oh, I got it actually, okay. I touched it at the very edge of the... I can still get that, I can still get that, I can still get this. <laughs> it's gonna change to a Goron soon, okay, let's leave that. Just just to play it safe, because I want to get the... Oh, shoot. <sighs> See, a minus 30 is quite a lot in this game. <laughs> uh, 
Okay. I only got those, I think, because I had them better memorized this time, but, well, but well, but well. Oh, that, oh, it didn't even give it me a chance to shoot it the other way. Interesting, interest. Oh, that's the one that ro rotates the same way. Good, good, good. Shoots, shoots, and shoots some more. <laughs> Okay, good, good, good. Shoot, 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 go, 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 go! I gotta get this one over here too, if at all possible. Oh shoot, I'm actually falling behind a bit here. Let's go for this one more than anything. <laughs> okay, we're at a thousand, I can stop here. Um, I just wanna make sure I got this. <laughs> Cause I don't know if you have to get exactly, I mean, if, if exactly 1000 will count. But I'm just, I just wanted to hit that one target, just in case you need to be over a thousand, because I don't remember exactly. Alright, so that takes care of that. You broke your free record, nice work! Uh-huh, yes, 1,030 points, yes, that's enough for a prize! Alright, you know, I'll break these two, just for the fun of it this time. Yeah, how you like those apples? <laughs> I think they're possibly there to help you recover your rupees in case you lost big or something like that. Maybe, maybe. And a Ruto crown, nice. Uh, yes I would, but can I... Uh-huh, yes I got that. You're probably thinking that this game is now far too easy. If you think that, I assure you, you are missing out. Because you see, I have extended the course just for you! Now go and try to beat your high score! Alright, good luck. So now it's possible to get over 2,300 points, and you can get treasures ranging, um, like if you get past two, uh, 3,000, I mean 2,300, you can get treasures that are worth 500 points, but occasionally you'll get one that's worth uh, 2,500 rupees. Wait, did I say 500 points? I meant, yeah, rupees. All rupees is your prize. <laughs> so this is a pretty good place to get yourself a whole bunch of rupees if you're good at the game because you can get the treasures relatively quickly here. So yeah, this is going to play out mostly the same up until that corner that I said it's going to divert over there. So we're just going to shoot our way through there and do our best. You don't, like, you don't get, like, like a heart container or anything like that, I believe, if you do get 2,300 points. So I don't really think I'm going to be all anal about getting 2,300 points of this part, because I could always do that off camera and then show you, like, a, a successful recording or something like that later on if I should fail to get that many points, but, you know, we'll, we'll cross that bridge if we need to. <laughs> just, we'll just, just kind of play it by ear here. Just don't want to, don't want to extend the part to go for 10 hours like that, that one shooting minigame in Phantom Hourglass, oh god. Oh god, that one was just... Oh, oh, if do you remember that? Oh, I remember that. How, I could never forget that one. <laughs> I am traumatized by that shooting minigame. Can I get that one more time? I think I can. Yeah, I can get that. There we go. Delightful! Um, you gonna forget to turn back around? There you go. Good boy. <laughs> There we go, I think I'm actually at a better pace than I was last time, so I'm gonna actually- oh shoot, I'm actually have a shot at getting that. Uh, oh, it does turn around. Oh shoot, I don't, I don't wanna- mm, so I'm gonna get this one. This one's easier to get. <laughs> Nailed it, okay. Now I'm again behind pacing here. Gotta get a little bit more ahead in my shooting skills. Uh -huh. Yes, yes, yes. Tap, tap, and tap some more! Yes, yes, so I'm trying to shoot as soon as I'm able to shoot. That's why I'm I'm mashing the screen here. <laughs> Just mashing where there's a target and hoping for the best, I guess. Okay, I'm gonna try and get that... Ah, oh, poopers. I was gonna say, I'm gonna try and get it on the, the second route there as it turns around, but nope, nope. Alright, so now I'm, I'm kind of flying blind here. <laughs> yeah, okay... Yo! Oh, because I don't remember the route entirely. <laughs> oh shoot, oh shoot, it's going to turn into a Goron quickly. Uh, this one is... that's in a really awkward spot. Let's, <laughs> let's kind of ignore that one. And more aerial targets! Go! These are closest to us, so I'm shooting them first, but I really want the red ones more than anything! Woo! Holy jeez, this is a lot of targets this time. <laughs> I gotta really gotta get this one. Uh, this one. This, 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 this. Yes, yes, yes. I'm gonna turn back and get this one. They, they have the, the look of the trees in Super Mario 64 and that they always face you, no matter what angle you look at them in. 
Yeah, I'm definitely behind the uh, point totals now. I, at least I think I am. Uh, well, we'll see. I mean, I might, I might get something good out of this. But yeah, it's a pretty, it's a pretty tricky mini game to get uh, 2,300 out of. But more often than not, you will be getting more than what you spent on this sucker by the end of it. <laughs> Alright, so now I will be able to get the next treasure up prize, but not the super grand Goro prize. Congratulations, you got like 1,870 points, you get a Goro prize! Any Goron you show this to will be oh so jealous! <laughs> but yeah, this isn't the best prize you can get, but it's still gonna be pretty dang good. <laughs> All right. No, I would not. I'll. I guess I'll go for the 2,300 later on. But oh wait, how do you get? Where is the? Where's the a spot that I hop up? Oh, I'm on the other side now. Yeah, yeah, that's right. It poops you out over here. I forgot about that. It's been a while since I played this. <laughs> All right, I'm ready to go. So. Whew, one more rabbit to get in this part, and I'm going to be getting it on my way over to the Temple of Spirits. So I'm just going to do the list straight on down that way. And continue on, I suppose. Should I cut? I think I should cut. Alright, new tracks. Right over here. We've got a slow down sign. And a rabbit somewhere in this vicinity. Oh, there it is. Shoot. That, okay, I was gonna say, did I miss it there for a second? Uh, I guess the tree did not get in my way. Ooh, it was close. Well, this one's pretty slow. I could put, oops, I can put it right in front of its face, and it should be. Dang it. And shoot, shoot. Oh, of all the rabbits for me to miss, that's the one that I miss. Okay, fine. <laughs> well, in any case. I can go ahead over to the Temple of uh, the Tower of Spirits and stop there, then come back out, and then you know try and get the rabbit again, then reverse to get back over here and whatnot. So yeah, it's in a relatively convenient spot for me to retry over and over if need be. Unlike that other one behind the temple, just like in the most out of the way spot possible. <laughs> the first little cutscene, as long as they're back here. I was gonna end it at this cutscene, but. That's what happens with the rabbit sometimes. Looks like the Tower of Spirits is back to normal, Link. But I can still feel an evil presence surrounding it. Does this mean we stop the Demon King's resurrection? At any rate, we should go to the altar at the top where he's in prison. I'm also worried about Anji, so we really should hurry. Before we go, though, I just want to say thank you for everything. I'm so grateful. But though we've come this far, there's still more we need to accomplish. So, shall we press ahead? Eh, I'm tired. <sighs> You must be joking, you can't really be tired. Kidding, kidding. That's great to hear. Let's go. <laughs> Alright, but really, I would like to go... Tower of Spirits is back to normal. Uh-huh. Uh, I would like to go outside first. There we go. Yes, yes. We'll, we'll just go head over fire. There we go. We got all four directions open to us now, so... We can use this uh, the Tower of Spirits here as like a central location to poop ourselves wherever we may need to go uh, in the world for the most part. It's often quicker to use the warp gates if you have them unlocked and stuff like that, but... Well, but, well... <laughs> Alright, rabbit round two. Here we go. Oh man, this... And that, that was the, like the slowest rabbit I dealt with this part too. That was just horrendous. <laughs> So, yeah, in the next part I'll be uh, doing the Tower of Spirits' final floors. And uh, seeing where that leads us story-wise and whatnot. But first, can I shoot this rabbit from a distance so I don't have to go all the way up there? Like, can I Can I just like... There we go. Because I'll have to... It'll take me a while to reverse to get back over there. <laughs> oh, come on, really? Yep. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Yeah, there we go. There we go, all right. And with that final rabbit capture, I'm gonna end off the part here, finally. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part when I finally get back over to the Tower of Spirits reversing the whole way. <laughs> I suppose I could have turned myself around at the next junction, but I still think that doing it this way would be a little bit faster. Maybe, maybe, well, now it is, because we're already over here, so we can't change our mind now. 